Hey everyone, it's Up North Collectors here. We're opening up the brand new 2020 Top Series 1 Baseball. These are the collector's tins. They're supposedly exclusive at Walmart, but we found these at our Meyer store. Meyer is a local, well, I guess not local, but a Midwestern uh, department store, kind of like a Walmart. And we found them there, but they also were at our Walmart. So they were $15.97 at Meyer, and I don't know if they are the same at Walmart, but they're right around the $15, $16 mark. And we'll show you what you get here, and we'll show you the odds. Now, yeah, quick, take the shrink wrap off. Um, first off, there actually are only six um, tin designs. We actually end up getting all six. So Mookie Betts, Judge, Pete Alonzo, that's Vlad Guerrero in the corner, Trout, and Cody Bellinger There's are the Vlad. six different kinds. These tins are actually pretty sweet looking. Yeah. Just by, like, the tin itself is probably worth a couple bucks just because they're cool. Yeah, I've seen them on eBay already selling for 5 to $10 just for the tin. Um, so there is the odds and stuff. So same thing as normal, everything in here. Um, so you get 75 cards per tin, one exclusive Decades Chrome Best insert, five Turkey Red inserts from 2020, and one Chrome Turkey Red 2020 card. Yeah, pretty nicely packaged here. So a little foam piece over top and just the cards right here. So. Yeah, and I think the one that is probably be most coveted is going to be the exclusive Chrome Decades Best Insert. Um, that, to me, would be one that's more rare than anything else because I don't think it's in any other product. Yeah, and there's a lot of them. There's It's a 100-card uh, checklist, so there's a lot of those um, to be collected, I guess. So see what we get out here. About the same amount of cards as a hanger box. Yeah, exactly. <clears throat> little less but with the exclusives you're probably at the you actually are at the same amount as a hanger box so keep flipping through here I can see the decades best chrome do my best to keep all stuff on camera yeah I, th I think there's been other videos out of this I haven't actually I've only watched one for a few minutes and you know so I'm not really sure how they you know do this but it looks like it's all in the middle the special stuff that's what I'm assuming, yeah. So we'll see. All right, we're now we're to the inserts. So we've got a 1990s Barry Larkin. This is actually going to be the black. So this will be numbered out of. I lied. Um, I thought it was going to be. Doesn't that look black right <laughs> it there? It looks black. It, it is black, be... but it's just probably the the regular base. Yeah. It's just the base. Anyway, That's a nice one behind there. But a nice Aquino. Yep. That's cool. Got a Miguel Cabrera. Lorenzo Kane. Stanton, Zuna, and Stroman Turkey Reds. Some Reese Hoskins cards. Freebies accepted in Daring Denial. So, yeah, those are the Walmart exclusives, the Hoskins. Burt Blylevin, a decade's best. Those cards That's, do look really that nice. That is a nice looking card. That yeah. card looks sweet. Um, now, I don't, I'll look in a second. I don't believe there are any parallels of these, but parallel, this would look sick. Yeah, and I don't a nice know. Otani oh, turkey nice. red chrome, yeah. too. So. And a Chris wow. Paddock gold out of 2020. So the golds in here are numbered, or I mean, the the odds of getting one are one out of three. So, and yeah. a rainbow foil is one out of two. So, not too, not too bad, not, actually. Compared to like, even like a hanger box, that's pretty much equal to not maybe. Maybe a little bit better. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know that. Yeah, there's a Boba that, Shet. That's, that's nice. nice. Pretty good value, I think, for the fifteen dollars. I would agree. I mean, just the decent way to build a base set and get some cool exclusive stuff. Uh, pretty cool. I like it. Um, and the tins themselves are just cool looking. Yeah, the tins. I mean, we hope to just to keep these and use them in, in a background there because they they look cool. Yeah, they are really really cool looking. So. So, so I'm going to open up the second one here, and we're just going to do two in this video just to give you guys a sample. But let us know in the comments below what you think about that first one, and if you think you're going to grab some. I know they're selling on eBay for $30, which is kind of crazy because I think you'll be able to find these. I mean, we found a bunch at um, our Meyer and then at our Walmart, and it's not, I can't imagine these are too short printed, but I could be wrong. Uh, but here's a Aaron Judge. Oops. Sorry for bumping the camera there. He uh, it was hurt last year, so didn't have the... Yeah, sorry, smashed the cards. 
Didn't have the season that everybody was hoping he would have. But good ball player. Actually, even though we're Red Sox fans, we actually like Aaron Judge. I know that's probably not something that we should say as Red Sox fans, but he's a good player. And he, 2017 cool was a year that really got us going in baseball. Um, a lot. Because we were collecting football heavily. And 17 was a year I'd say we really transitioned more to baseball than anything else. Um, or any other year, I should say. For sure, yeah. I mean, the rookie class was the best it had been in five years. Yeah, and then um, after that was Otani's year, so. A couple of good years. Now, last year was pretty good, too, and it's all been pretty decent. I'm going to put those down because that's just a big, huge stack. Even though I have big, big old hands, um, definitely. <laughs> A big stack. So there's a rainbow foil back there. I think those are what one in every two. Yeah, those are pretty common. Um, it'd be tough to get a good one just because you know there's only one and 350 cards, but you still have a shot at getting a nice rookie. So that'd be pretty cool. There he is, Max Scherzer, world champ, and Verlander. I know everybody's talking about the cheaters. I understand. Now here's our guy Brock Holt. Thanks to everybody who commented. Yes, he is now on the Brewers, and happy for him. Sad he's off the Red Sox, but at least he's on a team that has, uh, you know, a playoff potential written all over him, um, and a fun team. So I'll definitely be watching more Brewers games this year, just because he's on the team. And here is our rainbow foil, Kyle Hendricks. That's pretty cool. Now, I'm trying to think. I don't believe I've ever seen Topps tins before um, since I've been collecting cards. Yeah, I don't remember seeing them either. Let's go for more base, and then we'll go to the special cards. Um, I was just going to say the same thing when you are opening up your tin because, boy, when, if they have, when, they it has been a long time. When you were a kid, did they have tins? Um, No, not that I remember. Okay. Because I don't, I don't, I just don't think I've ever seen a tops tin. I've seen other kind, like upper deck hockey are always in tins. Not always, but they have a lot in tins. Yeah, they do. Yep. Um, I've seen like look pinnacle, at that. Two, two, two boxes, Boba two Boba Shuts. Not bad. I've seen like pinnacle baseball from a, like '90s probably has been in tins and stuff. So. That's a sweet fo uh, photograph. Yeah, I know. I, I know. I just <clears> never <throat> have seen tops tins. They look great. They look awesome. Yeah, this is something new. I mean, I know there's a million products out there, and they made a ton of Series 1. They always do, uh, but um, not bad in our estimation. Yeah, I think it's cool. I just think it's something different. I think this will, these will actually sell pretty well for them, um, especially people like us that just want to buy one with each player on it. Well, I tell you what, for gold, one out of every three tin has a gold. I don't know. That's pretty good. Um, yeah, but I also bet you out of, like, three hanger boxes, you'd get a gold, too. So. That could be. Yeah, I have to look at the odds. There's a Soto. These are the Turkey Reds. There's a Boba. Wow, this stuff is loaded with Boba Shet. Um, and then there's a Matt Chapman. And a Jeff McNeil. I don't even know that we have this card yet. We've opened up a lot of retail and a lot of turkey red. So there's the Reese Hoskins insert from Walmart. Behind this, I have, actually have another base card and another one. There's a Javi Baez. And oh, yeah, look at that. That's a gold. A though. gold. That's out of 50. Yeah. Dang. That ain't bad. It's pretty cool. Those are really tough to pull. Yeah, those are tough to pull. That's pretty sweet for Card's the PC. really, really off-centered. Yeah, yeah, it really is. Really bad. All right, let's go to the back and do the chrome turkey red. Marcus Stroman. And then our decade's best. Oh, that's cool. Catfish Hunter. Interesting. So 1970s, Catfish Hunter, decade's best. So that's pretty sweet. Not numbered. There's a look at the back has that 70s feel to it um yeah pretty sweet so yeah let us know what you think i would say they're a good value i'm glad we picked them up maybe pick up a couple more i like so them. i think they're cool just something different tins themselves are good the 
cards and to get that one out of 50 is not a bad card at all um, just by the rarity of it so pretty cool yeah i'd say there's value there i mean let us know what you think if you've opened them up did you get anything out of them and if so what did you get tell us in the comments below uh, once again, these run about $16, at least at Meyer uh, plus tax. Uh, if you buy them on eBay, people are asking $25 to $30. I'd just see if you can find them in your local store. Uh, save yourself some money. Um, and, uh, yeah, let us know what you think. So thanks for watching, guys. Hopefully you're having fun collecting Top Series 1 this year. Next week, Tops Heritage comes out, so buckle your seatbelts. Get ready for that. That's going to be a fun one. We have a bunch of that coming in, so get ready for mm -hmm. some good old times with Heritage. Oh yeah, big time Heritage. Alright, well thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one. Take care and have fun collecting.